LeBron James came who? Michael Jordan. After Michael Jordan came who? LeBron James. LeBron James. <laughs> so everything increases. So if you keep on a high holy day or Hanukkah and you haven't changed, who? They said Kobe. I'm sorry. Can't leave Kobe. Right, right. <laughs> <laughs> Lakers fans. Lakers fans. Lakers fans. If you don't change and increase, you're keeping the high holy day in vain. Because when you listen to this high holy day, right? This is speaking of something, that's, that's why it's powerful, the scripture they brought out in 4 Maccabees, because this is speaking of something totally different. We can go about the history of what happened to the people, but when we go and see and understand the rebuilding of the temple, the temple, what's the temple? Who's the temple? You, we are the temple. We all bricks to the superior temple, but as an individual, you are a temple. We got to have that clean temple, and the only way to clean the temple is up here. And this is why these scriptures, just, they actually breaking it down, describing to us, it's the mind. You understand? I agree with you got, King. Come. Come out one, come out one. Absolutely, 316. First Corinthians chapter 3, verse 16. Uh -huh. Know ye not that ye are the temple of the Most High God, Come on. and that the Spirit of the Most High God dwelleth in you. Come on. If any man defile the temple of the Most High, mm -hmm. him shall the Most High destroy. That's simple and plain. You can destroy the temple. We think it's all oh, the fault and all that putting stuff in your body. Of course, but it's your thoughts. Because it takes a thought to go buy the fork to eat the fork. Mm. Come? Come on. It takes the thought to go ahead and get the drugs to buy it and, and use it. Come? Come on. So clean them goddamn thoughts up. Come? Come on. Let's go back to the screen now, kid. Go back up. Now we're going to see how it ties in. And you can go back to our history, our physical history, how it brings to a spiritual understanding of what we need to do with our temples, our bodies, through our mind. Because it spoke about how it was so devout and everything that they needed to do, right? Yeah, yeah, now we understand this, right? It says priests of blameless conversation. What is a priest? Ones that do the operatives of the Creator. So your thoughts, every thought that you have, is supposed to operate as a priest, priestly. You understand? Blameless conversation, things that you can't even accuse your own self of. Okay, because at the end of the day, the wickedest demon you want to meet is the one you see in the mirror. All right, ain't no nigga outside of you. That nigga wicked out of you. No, nigga, it's you. It's you. Ain't no way. You got that. These are facts. You're the most wickedest nigga you want to meet. You're the most wickedest woman you want to meet. These are facts. And how could you prove that? Even if you're a good person and let's say a wicked nigga outside of you makes you angry, right? Then how, how wicked is that nigga if you got angry at him? Huh? God. You're a wicked nigga because you responded to his wickedness, his, God. his simplicity. God. See, so it's all on us. And that's what your house shop is teaching us, right? Now, a stone. A stone is what? Physically, it's heavy. Huh? So when it says about the stones, it's your thoughts. Your thoughts can weigh you down. The scriptures teach us that don't you let your thoughts weigh you down. You understand? God. So the devout stones is your wicked ass thoughts. Your thoughts that'll take you away from the most high, from giving you strength. And understand this, every element, everything that we go through is for the rebuilding of your own temple. How strong are you? How, 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 how are you going to do the will of the Most High if you don't go through anything? How do you test a car or a bike? By riding the goddamn thing, right? So how do you get the test to see how you love the Most High and how strong you are? By getting rolled till the wheels fall off. Huh? Oh All right? So we're gonna just make... Think about it. We don't see the Chinese bragging about they went to the moon. You don't see Africans bragging and saying they went to the moon. You don't see nobody saying that but the white man. Whether it's a lie or a fact, you have to understand that that man stands on a different level that you can't imagine. So until you get your brain fixed like his, you're not going to make it. You're not going to make it. He think he's grand, and that's the spirit that the Most High want us under. And that's the spirit that you keep these high holy days, Hanukkah, Passover, all of them for the rebuilding of yourself. The temple, the children of God. Come. Huh? Uh, so when you get into these scriptures and you hear these things, make them applicable for today. What you hear, apply it. Come. Huh? Uh, With a simple understanding. So the changes in your mind. You're going to have certain thoughts that's kind of like weird, kind of crazy, or kind of giving up on, on yourself, giving up on the law and your people. Okay? But you put gates around them, shields around them, and you walk in the spirit of the most happy. Just wanted to bring that out because I don't just want us to keep the high holy days. And AOC, we, we know how we always, you know, get, get into the scriptures like that. It's not just about keeping the high holy days and reading the scriptures or whatever. It's more to it than that. Because prayer begins when it ends. And it's the same thing with a high holy day. It begins when it ends. When it's over, how you going to walk in the spirit of the Maccabees? 
You understand? That's the spirit you gotta have. All that other stuff, we just coming together, having a good time, shaking, rattling, and rolling. We might as well keep Christmas. There's no difference. That's right. All right, I'm telling you. So let's just be in the spirit of the Most High. Come. Shalom to everybody. Happy Hanukkah. And Lord willing, we will see y'all next holy day. First of all, I just want to say all praises to the Most High, while the house y'all, and may many blessings to fall upon the, the children of Israel. Bless you, the Most High. Thank you. Shalom, Shah Kanaka. Happy piece of dedication. Most High bless everybody in Israel. Most High bless. Shalom. I'm right Right Huh? Right now. Yo, I'm in here with us sister. Sister Faye. My name is Imaya. I'm a blessed on the more side. I thank you. I believe. See him. Strong. Happy day to the sister. Love and strength and unity. Good sister. Okay? Food is good, baby. A shark on a car. Well, Baraka, thank you. Joshua Allah. All right? Come on. Come on, this man. We had a beautiful job tonight with the closing. Love the piece of dedication. Now, here you missed it. Let's all go to the next one. Wherever you are, all crazy. Let me just close it up. 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 Y'all not messing with her flashlight, son. Her flashlight is official. Get it at her website. <laughs> Shalom, Israel. Most I bless you all. And happy Hanukkah. Today is a day of celebration the Most High made for us to rededicate ourselves to Him. So, Guam Yasharala and rise. No! I got spirit. Wait, wait, you have it on live? Shalom. That's what I say. <laughs> Giving everybody what they're eating. I see that. She's shy, just like me. Every time. Every time when I'm Happy Hanukkah! Happy Hanukkah, Shalom! Remember her from the last video? The cookout? All praise for the Moka. Shalom. Shalom, Baraka Day Yahweh. All praise to the Most High. Shalom, Sean Nathaniel, Masters of Christ, aka Alpha Omega Clan. Happy Hanukkah. The Most High bless you and keep all of you. Continue and endure in the truth. Shalom. Oh, oh, that's nice. No, 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 I'm good. Shalom. Most High bless. Shah Khan Khan. Praise the Most High. Bashim Yaw Shah. Salute to the sister, Judy McGann. Sister, diligent sister in this faith, came all the way out here from North Carolina to come out here and be with her brother. So, hope it's for the most high. May she uh, get back there and say that she came. This burning us. It's hot. But I wish it was right there. The faith in the Most High and Christ, all things will follow. Excuse me for eating and talking on the camera. Then she cuts it off.